Hello, this is Wesley. Um, on, on, my, on, my, on my druid playing as Wesley Cat, as you can see, there's someone spamming PvP on my chat box. Um, anyways, I found something really funny with Hello. one of the quests in uh, Uldum, specifically the introductory quest. Um, apparently, you can one. ride in the wagon as different forms. I've ne I've never known that known about this myself. Um, and I haven't seen any videos on it, so I thought I'd show you how, how it works. So, we're about to get on this camel. And get on there. And, yeah, you stay in your bird form. That's right. <laughs> calling me a night elf and I'm a freaking bird. No one rides the lady. Why would, why would I want to ride anyone? I'm a freaking bird. Yeah, but she's not too smart. And yeah, for some weird reason, I decided to ride the oh wagon or, and continue flying, hovering inside the wagon with no room to flap my wings whatsoever. But as usual, wild physics defies everything. Uh, blizzard gods for the win, etc. Whatever. And so here we are, casually traveling through the desert, temple area, whatever you want to freaking call it. As you can see, I'm still a bird. For some unknown reason, I guess they decide to, hey, let's not change the form on anything, let's just keep them as a bird. Even though birds, well, apparently they have pea-sized brains and I apparently that means me too. Funny, weird, attacking dudes with weird voices, and as you can tell, I am not at all intimidated. While the others are, why didn't I just fly away? I mean, is it that hard to just fly away? Well, I guess maybe it's not going to be that smart with people pointing guns at me. But, yeah. And so, this is not the funniest part yet either. So here we are at the temple, or prison, or whatever you want to call it. And as you can see, I'm still in my bird form. I don't know what to make of this. I'm still in my bird form, but it doesn't end there. No, it doesn't. Three, he would have paid five easy. Dummy, uh, well, okay. What kind of civilization is? What kind of civilization uses coconuts as currency? Anyways, as you can see, all of a sudden I've stopped flapping my wings. I'm just still bird. My wings are still sticking out of the cage. And only after the cinematic do I turn it back into my normal form. But yeah, of course you can't move. I can still turn my. I can still shape shift as I want. As you can see, I'm in my bird form. There's my kitty form. Not as a pillion, but hey. So yeah, I had, it took me a while to figure out figure out how to uh, redo the quest. All you have to do is just simply abandon, and you're free. So and let's speed this up a little bit because no one likes to watch a druid with a normal flying skill. Uh, spend the next 10 minutes flying back to where he got the quest. I really need to get a swift flying form. It's just ridiculous. And as you see, I had a little fun with the uh, shape shifting. Hey, when you're when you're when you're spending 10 minutes flying from one point to another, you know you're bored. Actually, I think maybe have been more about five minutes. So back at the quest cover to try it in a different form. Safe travels. This time we'll do it in cat form. So here we go. Is that me digging? I'm digging into the ground and I just stopped. <laughs> Stop calling me a night elf. I'm a cat now. <sighs> I 
she is one dumb lady. Oh, here we go. At least in this form, it's plausible to ride in the wagon, as opposed to the bird. Seriously, why, as a bird, why don't you just fly over the dang Ahoy! thing? Avoid the whole mess of intruders and everything. Or I'll psycho primitive midgets. I mean, that's basically what they are, they're little midgets. Little midgets riding hyenas. Hyenas could easily just eat them alive, eat them for breakfast. They could live a long time doing that. So there I am in cat form. Not sitting or anything, just just standing there looking around. Gee, I can't possibly know what's about to happen. Hmm. I couldn't possibly know. Oh wait, it's them again. Cue the weird attack sound. Yeah, I don't know what kind of language you speak in. Again, I am not terrified. I'm just sitting there like, okay, whatever, this is no big deal. I've been through this before. It's not like I haven't been through it before. Nothing new. Jeez, we've, we've, ta we've taken down the Lynch King, but there's no way that we're going to get bested by a bunch of midgets. So here we are, back at the zoo, but I mean temple. And... As you can see, I am still a cat. I might as well be an exotic pet now. One that hunters cannot tame. Ha ha ha. Anyways. So, not as exciting as the bird, but as you can see, I am frozen again. Just looking at the ground. That's what I find odd about this quest. It's like, as soon as it pans back over to you, it. You're frozen. Which I find rather funny. It's even funnier in bear form. So here we go, back to the quest giver. I sped this up twice as fast hey as the last time. See you around. And we're gonna just it's not much of a change, but we'll do travel form. And do a different angle this time so you can actually see the digging. I swear he is doing digging. And yep, that is digging. Wow, that's a fat that's fast digging. Oh, back to normal. Uh, I am not a night elf, I am a cheetah this time. <sighs> I could I could run faster than those than uh, those guys, little convoy. Not the druid why don't you just shape shift and fly? I don't know well. Ahoy! Oh shut up you get sick of hearing you doing your little ahoy thing. So, here we are again. It's, gee, it's deja vu all over again. I, I bet a hundred gold I know what's going to happen next. So, there I am in travel form. A little easier to see now because I'm yellow against a, a brown wagon, dark brown. I wonder why it has a horde insignia on the wagon. Uh, anyways, here come the midgets with their weird attack language. And again, even the cheetah is not is not terrified. Look at that. God, what a point, what a bunch of pussies. <sighs> they will never learn. And you're gonna get three coconuts for the ugly one. Whoever the ugly one is. Not five.
And here's the zoo. I mean, temple. You know what? It's the zoo. Because. For one, there's a little. Later on, there'll be like a little tiger hybrid humanoid thingy chained to the wall, which you don't see right now. And then, of course, there's just me in my various forms. I'm just the special exclusive pet that you get. Pretty much. I told you to get three coconuts. And came back over, and yes, I am frozen again in the exact same position as I was before. Just looking down. And now back into normal form. And in the quest again, so we can this time see what it's like in bear form. Let's get out of here. And I, I have to say, I am so glad that I got swift flying form today. I actually dinged 85 on my uh, Drew today, so... Uh, funny enough, I actually leveled my Drew as a level 80 character in Wrath of Lynch King, but I never got one. swift flying. So, bear form time. And, of course, the bear form it takes as well. Yay. <laughs> you dare tell me not to ride the llama. Or the camel. Whatever you want to call it, it's both a llama and a camel for all I'm concerned. I wonder how the heck the black can handle the weight of a full grown bear. And I run over and. That is one heck of a leap. For a bear, that is a big Ahoy! leap. Oh, shut up, you. And here we go again. Deja vu, numero, numero, uh, tres. I yeah, can't possibly know what's going to happen. It'd be hilarious if I all of a sudden the back wheels broke down and then you get captured. No, but no. Nothing creative. Just the same old ambush. We're going to catch you until you complete a few quests and you break out. So, yeah. Cue the ambush. Attack! And again. Of course, the bear is obviously not intimidated. I mean, you can't intimidate a bear. There's no way you could intimidate intimidate a bear, even if it had a terror, even ha if it had like a fear-like anima animation. There's no way it would ever use it. It just doesn't work for a bear. <sighs> so. To the zoo, the Temple Zoo. Yeah, that's might as well might as well be, be what it's called, the Temple Zoo. And of course, as you can see, I'm still a bear. What a bear bill just bust out of the cage. That'd be hilarious. Calls all mayhem everywhere. I mean, heck, in past quests, you've done a lot more they just bust out of a cage and of course the bear form is frozen which I find really funny so yeah that's the uh, four forms I unfortunately do not have a moon did not have a moon cane or a tree form to do it with uh, that's I'm too lazy to do the spec and nor do I Hello. ever plan on using those specs I'm a Feral Druid at heart. So, I'm just going to turn the quest in and be done with it. Get, get it up to 85 because I've, I've been really wanting to get the Fire Cat form. Uh, but that's going to be a long time away if, I, if I'm even that lucky. Maybe in the next expansion I'll be that lucky. See you later. So, yeah. Time for this kitty to get out. And yeah, look out to take out the guard. Whatever. So 
this was my first narrated uh, WoW video, so if um, if I find something else worthy of narrating later, I know I've uh, I'm still I still like I still like soloing stuff with my hunter. Um, in the future, I'll probably end up uploading something else that I solo. I really want to try to solo kill the loss, but I've been so involved with PvPing and all, and I want to get my druid into that. So, until next time, take care.